Hey guys, <clears throat> at our school we talked a lot about our character like being honest, practicing our patience, having courage and being brave. So um, I was watching the news and they talked about the Mars rover and they just named it Perseverance and then I was flipping through books to look to read for you guys on camera and I came across this one about Perseverance. I was like, oh, this must be a sign that I'm supposed to read this book today. <clears throat> so says keep trying little zebra and I know I have a lot of you guys that are animal fans so just kind of scream Mrs. Hayden come read me so here we go little zebra ran as fast as he could across the grassland wait up he shouted to the zebras speeding ahead of him but they left him behind in a cloud of dust Little zebra flopped to the ground. I give up, he cried. Doesn't sound like he's showing much perseverance yet, huh? <clears throat> What's wrong, little zebra? asked his mother. I can't run as fast as the others, he said. I'm tired of being the youngest in the herd. You will grow older, said his mother, and you will get faster. But I can't wait that long said little zebra. I want to be faster now. Just keep trying, said his mother. Maybe you can find other animals to practice with for a little while. That's a good idea, said little zebra. I'll go right now and find someone to run with. Little zebra met a tortoise under a tree. Will you race with me, asked little zebra. Sorry, chuckled the tortoise. I can't run. My shell is too heavy. Thanks. Try asking a baby ostrich. Little zebra found a baby ostrich. Will you race with me? Asked little zebra. You bet, said the ostrich. Whew, puffed little zebra. She's tiny, but she's fast. The ostrich ran through the grass, always two steps ahead of the little zebra. Maybe I should just give up, thought little zebra. But then he remembered his mother's words. Keep trying. The next day, little zebra raised the baby ostrich again. And this time he won. He pranced with joy, then trotted off to find someone else to race with. Do you guys think y'all could beat a baby ostrich? <clears throat> Soon little zebra spotted a young giraffe. Will you race with me, he asked. Sure, said the giraffe. Let's run to that tree. His legs are taller than I am, puffed little zebra as he galloped after the giraffe. This is hard work. Maybe I should just give up. But little zebra didn't give up. Instead, he tried harder. Every day for a week, the two animals raced. Each day, little zebra galloped a little faster. Finally, they ran side by side. I may win by a neck for now, laughed the giraffe, but keep trying and someday you will win by a nose. <clears throat> little zebra met a new at the water hole. Will you race with me? Asked little zebra. Okay, said the new. The speedy new zipped around the water hole with little zebra a few steps behind him. It's no use, thought little zebra. I'm just a slow pope. Then little zebra remembered his races with the giraffe. I did a good job of catching up with him, he thought. If I give up now, I'll never get faster. A few days later, little zebra inched past the new. You're ready to race a gazelle, the new said. Little zebra approached a young gazelle. Will you race with me? He asked. Ready, set, go, replied the gazelle. Off they zoomed. Little zebra could not pass her. Tears came to his eyes as he struggled to keep up. Keep trying, little zebra called the gazelle. You're the fastest little zebra I've ever seen. Really? asked little zebra in surprise. But you're faster. I can't get ahead of you. Only a cheetah can outrun me, said the gazelle.
Little zebra spotted a ch cheetah asleep on a rock. Her cub played nearby. Could I keep up with a cheetah? He wondered. Will you race with me? He asked the cub. The cub padded over to little zebra. <clears throat> he blinked up at him and then rolled over on his back laughing. I'm so small and you're so big, said the cub. I wouldn't be able to run fast until I'm older. Don't worry, you'll grow and you will get faster, said little zebra. And practice helps. Just keep trying. Saying this made little zebra feel very grown up. Little zebra, zebra trotted back to his herd. I've tried my best and I've grown some too, he thought. Today, I'll see if I can race with the zebras. When the other zebras began running, little zebra ran too. They zoomed and zipped and zigged and zagged. This time, little zebra was able to keep up and was surrounded by all his zebra friends. The end. How do you think he felt when he was able to keep up? You think he felt good? I do. I think he probably felt proud. <clears throat> and even though he got really frustrated and he almost started crying, he kept trying, right? Just like we always keep trying because it can't never could. And mistakes make our brain grow. So I miss you guys. Love you guys. Mwah. See you later. Bye.